Hi, this is Dr. Michael Ryan with Missouri Vein Care answering a question, what is blood pooling in your legs? Blood pooling in your legs is uh, another way to describe something called uh, chronic venous insufficiency. That's the medical term for abnormal vein circulation in the legs. And it's not a dangerous condition. People don't die from it. They don't get blood clots. They don't lose their legs or get amputations. But it is a circulation condition and affects people by developing symptoms and they develop also fatigue. And the result of that is that people end up usually not being as active as they could be, not getting quality sleep, which affects their overall energy level and their health uh, is, is negatively impacted. And the end stage of that for many patients, it results in people feeling pretty exhausted, especially at the end of the day and also throughout the day. And the result of that is that people end up cutting corners, they sit down, they take more breaks, they aren't as active as they used to be, they skip exercise, they sit around in the evening instead of walking around doing chores and activities. And the result is that people tend to burn fewer calories and the result of that is people gain weight. So we see that quite commonly at the end of the, the spectrum of, of uh, blood pooling in the legs. As it starts out, it's usually uh, fairly uh, mild and the legs are heavy and, and you may have some discoloration in the, in, the, in the feet or lower calves. And you can also develop visible veins. And usually it starts out with tiny spider veins around the ankle. That's the biggest clue, uh, usually on the inner ankle. Uh, and, and eventually those can develop into more prominent varicose veins. Varicose veins are veins that are bulging from the surface and uh, those are usually a sign of more advanced and long-standing um, blood pooling. The treatments are, are really quite uh, user-friendly and very effective these days. The first thing we recommend is that people try some compression stockings. We do that for a couple reasons. One is most insurance plans are gonna want to have you try them before they approve a treatment. So go ahead and get some and try them out. Most people actually find that they help uh, a little, maybe not completely, and that gives people some relief and allows them to maintain their, their active lifestyle. And uh, the next uh, option is to do actual vein treatments. And we do that by basically eliminating these abnormal veins, the ones that aren't working. And when those veins are eliminated, the blood pooling goes away. The circulation reroutes automatically to other veins that are working normally. And the circulation speeds up. And symptoms uh, improve significantly or go away. And finally, the biggest surprise for most patients is their energy that was declining goes back up. And they're very surprised about that. But that's fairly predictable uh, when you treat a person with blood pooling or, or chronic venous insufficiency. So this is Dr. Mike Ryan talking about why is, uh, what is blood pooling in my legs?